Hello everyone, in this video I will be solving Cambridge A-Level Information Technology Paper 4 Advanced Practical for October November 2024. I will be solving task 3 animation. Other tasks are already done and uploaded. You can find the link in the description. You are required to animate the path of the planet Earth around the sun. Set the stage to match the size of the background image. I'll be using Adobe Animate to create the animation. So let's start with the new stage. Now the size of the stage must be matching to that of the background image. So this is the background image. Let's check the dimensions. Go right click properties, click on details. You can see the dimension here 900 by 480. So set the stage accordingly 900 by 480 and I have set the frame rate to 30. Create. Now background, this image will act as the background of the animation. So I'll drag it here. We'll be using earth and axis images for the animation. The earth and axis images must follow the path shown in the background. The animation must start at the affiliate points and travel at an even rate around the sun. So it will start from this point and then it will move around this path. The light side of the earth must always face the sun. The light side means this white part of the earth should always face the sun. The text must uh, appear as earth passes each point. There are some text shown at each point that should appear when the earth reaches that point or passes that point. The animation must take 8 seconds for the complete orbit. So the length of the animation is 8 seconds. So first layer is the background image. I'll rename it as BG and then it, I'll insert frame till 8 seconds so that the background remains till 8 seconds. Now I'll add another layer, a new layer for the earth image. Rename this as earth. Now add a new layer for the axis. <coughs> So this is the axis. Now the earth and the axis needs to move around along this path. So let's create a layer for the path and a new layer. I'll rename it as path. I'll hide the earth and axis so that the path is clearly visible. I'm using a pen tool to draw the path. Just trace the path roughly so that the objects can move around it.
So, this is the path. I have not joined it because it has to move from this path to uh, this point. Now, this path should be set as a guide so that the objects can move around this path. So, right click path layer, set it as guide. Now, drag the axis and earth below the path layer so that these move, objects will move around this path. Now let's animate the earth layer, lock the axis. And hide. Now in order to create the animation, let's convert this into symbol, right click convert to symbol. Insert classic tween. It will start from here. And at the end, at the end of eight seconds, it has to reach this point. Now let's check whether it's working. So you can see it is moving around the path. Now make sure when it reaches each point, at each point, the light side should face the sun. When it reaches this side, let's insert a keyframe and make sure the light side faces the sun. Not this point. Now at this point, let's insert a keyframe and then make sure the earth's light side faces the sun. Now at this point, insert keyframe and make sure the light side is facing the sun. Now insert keyframe here. So let's see the animation now. Now let's add the animation for the axis. Convert this to symbol, right click, convert to symbol. Insert classic tween. The axis will not change, it will move as it is. So at this point, we have to keep it here. Now let's see the animation. So 
So that is done. Now we have to enter the text. Text shown must appear as the earth passes each point. So at this point, the text equinox 23rd September must appear. So let's add a new layer above the background. New layer for the text. So at this point we need a text. Insert keyframe. Text. Equinox 23rd September. Now this should be the font is white color. Times New Roman, white color. Let's increase the size, 14. So now this size is almost matching. We can make it bold. Now it is match. So this text will appear here. Equinox 23rd September. Then at this point, solstice 21st September. So at this point, I will insert a keyframe. Solstice 21st. December Now next text will be here, insert keyframe, again text, equinox, twenty first March, Now here solstice 21st June. So insert a keyframe. Add text.
solstice 21st June. So we have added all the text. You can hide the path and let's see the animation now from the beginning. So the animation is working fine. The animation must restart and loop continuously. Save your animation as an animated GIF as orbit followed by your sender number, candidate number. So file, export. You can set the looping forever. And now let's export, save. The name is orbit followed by your sender number and candidate number. Save. You can test it to check it's working fine. So this is the end of the animation task. Other tasks web page will be uploaded soon. Thank you for now.